it is really uh, very fitting and very appropriate that on uh, this wonderful day that we call Giving Tuesday that uh, we are here at Heifer International, which is one of the internationally premier organizations that knows everything about truly giving back to people and giving them a wonderful, wonderful opportunity to help others. Um, I am so very proud that Heifer International calls Little Rock its home and what it means to helping families throughout the world. Uh, it is indeed fitting that we're here today on this Giving Tuesday. And of course, you know, on the heels of Thanksgiving and as we get into the holiday season, as you go to the Walmarts and the Targets of the world and you hear the Salvation Army bell ringers asking for money and, and all of these kinds of things, it's important for us to remember that um, this Giving Tuesday is a campaign to really create a national day of giving uh, as we start the annual holiday season. And so uh, we're here today to encourage our citizens to open up their hearts, open up their pocketbooks, and to uh, help those that are less fortunate. It's an opportunity for all of us, uh, not just those here that are assembled, but everybody to contribute uh, and, and to help to uh, continue with what Americans are known so well for, and that is volunteerism and philanthropy. Um, I think if you ask anybody around the world, they'll tell you that, that Americans are some of the most generous people in the world. And certainly the opportunity to not only give of your fortune, but to give of your time and your talents is so very, very important. Uh, that's why today I, as one of my responsibilities and duties as mayor, am issuing a proclamation, which I would like to read to you if I could. Uh, and it reads as follows, know ye all people by these presents and greetings. Whereas Giving Tuesday was established as a national day of giving on the Tuesday following Thanksgiving, and whereas Giving Tuesday is a celebration of philanthropy and volunteerism where people give whatever they are able to give, and whereas Giving Tuesday is a day where citizens work together to share commitments, rally for favorite causes, build a stronger community, and think about other people, and whereas it is fitting and proper on Giving Tuesday and on every day to recognize the tremendous impact that philanthropy, volunteerism, and community service has on the city of Little Rock and our citizens. And whereas Giving Tuesday is an opportunity to encourage all of our citizens to serve others throughout this holiday season and during all other times of the year. Now, therefore, I, Mark Stodola, the mayor of the city of Little Rock, uh, do hereby proclaim December 3rd, 2013, as Giving Tuesday here in the city of Little Rock. Uh, in witness thereof, I have. I signed this earlier this morning, and uh, we'll make this an official part of, of today. Um, we've all participated in a variety of different things, whether it's donating coats or uh, a canned food drive for the Arkansas Food Bank, uh, whether it's uh, the gift of a rabbit or the gift of a goat and the offspring that helps to uh, help a family uh, uh, find sustainability. Uh, in the remote parts of our world, such as Heifer has been doing uh, for dozens and dozens and dozens of years, or whether it's um, a monetary contribution. Uh, it is uh, very important that we take today and we rem remind ourselves that while this is Giving Tuesday and it's a national day, every day should be a day of giving. And so as we go through the rest of the week and we go into next week and the week following, I want all of you to, to spread the word of cheer and, and, and blessing on our citizens with, with whatever your philanthropy can be, whatever your willingness and ability to give can be. And it may not be in simple monetary terms, but it may be in terms of your effort, your time. It might be helping an elderly person uh, get into a store. Uh, it may be helping them do their shopping. Now, there are so many different ways that we can give. Uh, and we have some of those nonprofits with us today. Uh, I want to uh, turn this podium over now to uh, some of our uh, organizations that are with us to further elaborate on the importance of Giving Tuesday. Uh, we have representatives here from the Arkansas Food Bank, from the Arkansas Nonprofit Alliance, uh, City Year Little Rock, uh, the Goodwill Industries of Arkansas, of course, Heifer International, and Winrock International. 
Uh, our speakers uh, are going to be first Rhonda Sanders, the CEO of the Arkansas Food Bank, uh, and then uh, Pierre Ferrari, the CEO here of Heifer International, and uh, David Norman, the uh, group president, vice president for Winrock International. Rhonda? Thank you, Mayor Stodola and Heifer International for uh, hosting today and for each of you for being here. It's truly an honor and a pleasure for the Arkansas Food Bank to be here today to celebrate the opportunity we have with Giving Tuesday. Arkansas has about 580,000 people who wonder where their next meal is going to come from. About 77,000 of those live right here in Pulaski County, very close to home. The Arkansas Food Bank and many other nonprofits who are here today are working diligently not just to provide food, but to provide shelter, safety, comfort, health, and hope to those in need in our community. Days like today remind us of all the things we have and of the opportunity that we have today to take advantage and to give to those around us who have fallen on difficult times. Together, we truly can create a community where no one has to go hungry. I thank you and I encourage each one of you to give today to help those around you. Thank you, Rhonda. Um, so we've had a past, there's some very interesting past few days. Uh, Thanksgiving on Thursday and then Black Friday and then the weekend to recover from that and then everybody at the keyboard buying again on Cyber Monday. And uh, you kind of wonder what's the whole purpose of it all. You know, and I think we're all searching for some kind of happiness or some, something in, in the buying. Well, it turns out that uh, all the research in 136 countries has pointed out that giving is the source of happiness. And today is Giving Tuesday, so today is really Happiness Tuesday. Let's make it a really happy day and let's give. Okay, thank you so much for coming. It's a real pleasure for me to be here to talk about an important aspect of personal philanthropy, uh, and that's volunteerism. Um, I, th I think one of, the, one of the things that we often don't appreciate uh, as organizations is, is the value of people's time, and number two, the value of their expertise, the thing that they've worked the hardest to gain, their skills that they can contribute to a, a, a nonprofit or a phil philanthropic endeavor. Uh, Arkansas has an extremely unique, little, especially Central Arkansas, has a really unique environment that, that cultivates volunteerism. Uh, we all grew up watching our parents volunteer, you know, school board, PTA, very civic activities. But today, here in Central Arkansas, we have almost an unparalleled set of opportunities to volunteer and engage. Uh, organizations uh, uh, such as... 